Rochester city leaders have voted in favor of potentially raising property taxes. The tax levy is set for next year. The approval city council voted on is for a 6.5 increase. This increase is for the Mac is the maximum for property taxes. It can be reduced if necessary. Our Carly Petrus joins us live in the studio to break down what this all means. So Carly, what does this mean specifically for homeowners? Well, Tom and Caitlin, this maximum needed to be decided so city council and staff are able to continue working on the budget. That means nothing is set in stone right now. The property taxes Rochester will collect in 2022 are being capped at $86.8 million, or a 6.5% increase from 2021. So what does this mean for you? According to the City Council, the 6.5% is not the rate increase taxpayers will see. If just with the new property and the property values, we've made up 4.5% of the 6.5% increase we're putting out. So that, that helps me understand it. City Council members say the average home will see a $25 increase in their taxes. That is, if your home value does not increase. Some council members are open to ideas on lowering taxes. I hate this idea that we have to be asking our community, community members to pay more when we know so many people are struggling. And I also value the services and supports that our community provides and the idea that we are trying to grow a community where people want to and are able to live and work. But the council needs specific ideas from the city on where to cut funds. This could include public input. That's a great time to have conversations to figure that out. But I think at this point, you know, um, I've watched staff work really di diligently to try and get these numbers uh, down as, as far as I think we can. The required public hearing to vote on a final tax budget will be December 6th. Back to you. Thank you, Carly.